Exercise 5 show unit status as of on. In the previous exercise we placed a round LED widget to show the variable unit on, the global unit status. Now we will place right beside another widget showing off on. We have to place a widget number variable, this one. We have to make it some space. Then make it a little bigger. So the variable I told you is the same variables variable that drives the LED is a unit on this one. Now we have to write somewhere that we want to show there off on rather than 0 1 or false true whatever else. So we can start creating here in the solution explorer we have to create a new global list we can give a name gl like global list of on looks a good name in the first column we have to write the name of the variable the sorry the value of the variable that we will use a boolean so will be false and true and there are several options actually we can also add more uh, options so we can show instead of uh, false true a uh, color an image uh, the stroke uh, the object a uh, text uh, value and so on in our case uh, is a uh, text so false off true on and then we have to use uh, this uh, global list in this uh, widget so in the enum list mode click browse here is uh, the global parameter okay okay finish save distribute reload frame Here is, okay, it's not perfectly centered, off, uh, sorry, on and off. So this and this shows the same variable. Okay, very good. Works. Now, before the summary, we can, uh, it is the good moment to make a backup. I told you in uh, the first uh, video that uh, all project uh, objects are saved in uh, just one file, one single file, called uh, nodesdb, saved in the project folder cweb, is uh, this one you know, in our case. So how to make a backup, simply copy, copy, paste and rename a size 5 ok this is our backup to restore it simply ok delete or rename notes db and rename this to notes db ok summary so we have seen how to show a text, but the same process can be used to show images or a color according to the value of a variable. In this case, the name of the variable was unit on, like the ones for the LED. So we started placing the variable widget, then we have created in the Solution Explorer a new global parameter. We gave a name define the pair key that is the value and text so false of true on and then we use the 
that um, global list in uh, here in the widget uh, in the variable widgets. That's all.